This video will explain how to do advanced keyword searching. Successful advanced searching techniques will enable you to execute a careful and systematic search that should result in a set of useful records. However, effective keyword searching requires some preparation. Suppose you are looking for information on the topic, the role of exercise in heart health. For this topic, we can identify two main concepts, exercise and heart. Notice that only the core concepts are chosen, words like effect of, relevance of, influence of, or role of typically should not be used as concepts. Also remember that a concept can be defined by many keywords with similar meanings. For example, the concept heart may be called cardiac or cardiovascular, while physical activity may be used for the concept exercise. To further broaden your concepts, you may search for variations of your keywords or use the singular and plural forms, which can be accomplished through the use of wildcards or truncation. In most databases, including the library catalog, the wildcard symbol is an asterisk. So a search for gene asterisk will get references with any number of letters following the characters G, E, and E. For example, gene, genes, genetics, or genetically. Now that we have identified concepts and some synonyms, let's use Boolean operators, OR, AND, and AND NOT to execute this search. By placing an OR between search terms, you will find records containing any one or both of the terms. This will broaden your search considerably. So, if you use the OR connector and the wildcard symbol, a search for your two concepts can be represented as follows. Now that you have created search statements for each concept, let's combine these statements with the AND operator. This will narrow your search and give you a smaller, more focused set of results. Both concepts will be represented in every reference you retrieve. You're now ready to search for your topic. Choose the advanced search in the library catalog and enter the keywords for the first concept after the first any field box and those for the second concept after the second any field box. Notice that the word AND is at the end of each search box. This will combine these two search statements into one search. The references you will get from this search will contain at least one of the con keywords from each concept. Another way you can do this search is by nesting where you use parentheses and the Boolean connectors to combine the two search statements. If you enter the search, as in this example, it will produce the same references as the previous search. Now, let's use the AND NOT connector to reduce the number of records that are retrieved or to exclude items from the search. Suppose you want to exclude studies done on athletes. You can represent this in the following search statement. The records you retrieve will not contain words with the stem athlete in the record. Now, let's look at a relevant reference that you have found. Notice that cardiovascular system and aerobic exercises are linked subject terms. You may click on one of these subjects to see all records under the heading. If you want to combine two of these subject terms, you can copy and paste them into the advanced search, selecting subject and and from the pull-down menu. To recap, the following steps are recommended for successful keyword searching. Write your research question or topic in one or two sentences. Identify the main concepts. List synonyms for your concepts. Use Boolean connectors and or and not to link your concepts together and use wildcards where appropriate. Based on your results, identify a few good subjects to refine and focus your search. If you would like further assistance, please contact the reference department or your subject librarian in person, through chat, by phone, or through email.